There are so many cameos in Deadpool and Wolverine that even leading man Ryan Reynolds seems to have trouble keeping track of them all. On Monday, stunt coordinator and assistant director George Cottle revealed on his Instagram stories that Harry Holland, the younger brother of Marvel star Tom Holland, has a small role in the superhero sequel as one of the many variants in the film's Deadpool core. When director Sean Levy and Reynolds set the bar so F-I-N-G high, even the stunt team needed a special guest star. Cottle wrote over a photo of Harry in costume on set. It may not be the Holland the world wanted, but it was the Holland we all needed. Harry, you smashed it, my friend. Harry, who previous screen credits include his brother's movies The Impossible and Cherry, reposted Cottle's photo and added, lots of cameos in Deadpool. That set off a humorous back and forth as Reynolds reposted Cottle's message and wrote, This is how I find out? You tell me? Cottle then told Reynolds, All good things come to those who wait, sir. He also responded to Harry, Harold Poole for the win. Harold Poole shows up in Deadpool and Wolverine's big third act fight scene when the titular antiheroes played by Reynolds and Hugh Jackman fight their way through the Deadpool core, an army of alternate reality versions of the Merc with a mouth. While Deadpool and Wolverine are at first successful in cutting down all the Deadpool variants, they're shocked to see them all get back up after a moment, because they, along with audiences, forgot for a few minutes about Deadpool's ability to heal from any injury. Other cameos in the Deadpool core include Reynolds' wife, Blake Lively, as the voice of Lady Deadpool, Matthew McConaughey as the voice of Cowboy Deadpool, Reynolds and Lively's seven-year-old daughter, Inez, as the voice of Kidpool, Nathan Fillion as the voice of the undead floating head headpool, and Paul Mullen, a soccer player on the Wrexham AFC football team that Reynolds owns, as Welshpool. The movie resurrects former Marvel heroes from their pre-MCU days as well. Chris Evans' fantastic. For character, Johnny Storm, Jennifer Garner's Elektra, from 2003's Daredevil and 2005's Elektra, Channing Tatum's Gambit, who never got his own movie, and Wesley Snipes' Vampire Hunter from the Blade trilogy which also featured Reynolds in 2004's Blade, Trinity. In theaters now, Deadpool and Wolverine also features appearances from Chris Hemsworth, John Favreau, Henry Cavill, Logan Alum Daphne Keene, and Aaron Stanford.